Johnson County school playgrounds go up in flames, and now police want to know who's behind it all. Sloan Heller is live at the Liberty View Elementary School in Olathe with more on that. Sloan, that site behind you is incredible. I know. Good morning, Curtis. You know, and it definitely doesn't seem like a coincidence here because we're talking about three elementary schools all in the same school district, Blue Valley School District, and all of these fires happening within a five-day time span. This most recent one here, again, Liberty View happening uh, early Tuesday morning. Just look at all of the damage here. Now that it's light outside, we can really see just how bad this fire must have been. We're being told the damage estimated at 75 $5,000. Uh, we were here yesterday talking to parents, talking to students, and everybody seems extremely angry and frustrated, not only because this is a place where kids hang out, of course, during the school year, but this is a really popular hangout during the summertime. And now, of course, this is just not an option. Uh, talking to police, they believe there is definitely a connection between all three fires. During the summer times, this neighborhood is full of kids. They always come up here and play. It's just a nice place to feel safe and, and let your kids play. And then you see this, it's just, it's pointless. And you just can't help but wonder who would have done this and why. And hopefully this is the final in the series of these playground fires. Again, if you have any information to help police catch whoever was behind this all, call the tips hotline. That number is 474-TIPS. Live in Olathe this morning, Sloan Heller, NBC Action News Today. Uh -huh.